Right, since the Elden Ring DLC is about to release, I mean, by the time this video is out, it has already been out for a couple of days, but I'm just, uh, you know, testing stuff out. That's some... Um, let's see, I do prefer a little bit of melee, so let's, uh, let's see, can... How much damage do I do to this little bastard? Ow, I'll almost one shot. Okie dokie, and attack. Ow, ow, ow. Bad doggo. Alright, how about this thing? I mean, the slugs are slow, I presume. I mean, we can do another one, right? And then... Oof. <laughs> okay, what about you? And a jump and an attack. Oh, okay. Jump and an attack. There we go. Loads of fire slugs around here. Mm, do I take fire damage? I don't. One thing that I have realized is, even though I played this game for over 100 hours, I've only played through it once, is that, I, yeah, there's still a lot of stuff to explore, and I do enjoy myself a little bit of exploration. Hang on. Yeah, I do also play on a keyboard. I do prefer that. Let's see, the birds are... Oh, hang on. That's a big hand. Okay, I do... Oh, where am I looking? Okay, and roll. Okay, a little bit of fire, maybe. They don't like fire. Whoop, and a fire. I thought. Let's see, uh, this button. Heal up. Oh, ow. Right, yeah, I mean, it's gonna be... Okay, can you stop doing that? Okay, more fire, please. And fireball. Ow. Okay, a little bit of this, maybe. A little bit more of this. Okay. Um, what killed it? Did I kill it? Huh. Have I discovered this thing? Yeah, okay, I have. Yeah, the controls are still eluding me a little bit. Okay, that's a giant fighting a bird. Another giant fighting another bird. Let's see, who's winning? No one is winning. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna leave them be. Hopefully they fight each other rather than me. Let's see, what is this place? That's another... Yeah, okay, I've been here too. Oh, weird controls. Church of Repose. Right. Let's see, let's do a little bit of rest. Now, I'm not sure if I should start a new character or what I'm supposed to do, but... Uh, I mean, we will see. Maybe a little bit of Dark Blade action. Let's try that against the bird. And a swoosh, and a swoosh. I mean, that's not doing a lot of damage. It's doing something. Oh, ow. Yeah, I need to get better at that. Whoosh. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. A little bit too slow again. Oh, 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 ow. Okay, two of these ones are gonna be difficult. And he's gonna charge, charge, and charge. Ow. <laughs> okay, they're fighting each other again. Good. Let's team up. Okay, then it's just a big boy. And a jump and an attack. And a jump and an attack. And a jump, another attack. Jump and another attack. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, there's going to be a lot of healing. Up oh, and up, oh, up. Oh. Oh, I thought I dodged that. Oh, to charge. No, say what now? Ow. Right. <laughs> I died. Uh, welcome to Dark Souls. Uh, let's see. Where's my stuff? At least it doesn't work the way that it used to. Hang on, they respawned. Oh yeah, everything responds when you die. Oh, right, yeah, of course it does. Now, one thing, I mean, I can just buff up like I usually do, do a little bit like that. I mean, usually I do this for bosses, but, uh, I mean, sure. Not sure if damage gets increased once I do this, but if I just load up and, yeah, I mean, look at this damage. <laughs> I mean, everything is just dead. <laughs> oh, the Blasphemous Blade is... Far too OP. <laughs> yep, yeah, there's, I mean, if I want to, this sword is going to carry me through the entire game, but that is why I prefer to try something else. Uh, more of an emergency weapon if I can't defeat the bosses. Yeah, it is, uh, it is very OP. Well, it is that, and also a little bit of heavy weapon action. Now I do wonder, what will this thing do against one of those things? Uh, let's travel to another location. Actually, maybe here? Where am I supposed to go? Is it that one? Maybe? Um, down here? There's a place that I usually farm the runes. Mikola Hill Tree. Not here either. Brave Rune. That sounds familiar. Yeah, this seems like the place. Okay, let's go. And whoop. Okay, and attack. That's a lot of damage. But I also took a lot of damage. Hmm. Oh, and away. Uh oh, that's a bomb. I, I didn't die. You bastard. Come on. 
There we go. And a whoosh. And a whoosh. I do like big weapons. And a jump and an attack. Ooh, not bad. Yeah, I like these weapons. I mean, not as long, uh, good as the blasts from a blade, but good enough. Oh, you watch. Ah, whoosh, whoosh. And a jump and an attack. And a jump and an attack. Oh, heal up a little bit. Careful with those. Run, jump, and attack. Come on in. Yes. Now, you say what? And dodge. And jump and an attack. Aha. <laughs> Yeah, I think that I'm prepared for the DLC. Properly. Maybe. Maybe, just maybe. Ah, that's an explodey boy. Oh, and whoosh, whoosh. Okay, jump and an attack. Come on in. Whoosh. And a whoosh. Okay, a little bit of fire dash. And oh, oh. Okay, sure, do, do your thing. Let's see, can I hit this feather? I can. Uh, okay, sure. And a whoosh. <laughs> See, I also have this attack that is rather good, doesn't use a lot of mana. Hmm. Now, am I going to use this character, Nature? That is the question. I've defeated every boss, I don't think there's much more hidden around. Uh, probably not. I don't know, are there any more dangerous enemies in Kaelid? Uh, probably. Fort Ferreth? Maybe? Oh, I don't remember much. I haven't played this game for over two years. Or at least, now uh, maybe two years. Let's see, here was the dragon that you could cheese, yeah. Oh, the beginning of this game, all of the blood damage and the sword of night and flame. <laughs> that was my go-to. Uh, I remember some poor bastard invaded me and I <laughs> one-shot him with a wall of fire. Uh, Alright, let's see, are there any enemies around here now? Or, I know that I've seen dragons. Kind of want to fight a dragon again. Let's see, dragons? I think I can smell a dragon. Is that a dragon? No, oh, that's just a branch. Here's something. That's a dragon. Okay, let's uh, go out and fight a dragon then. Come here, dragon. And a smash. Okay, let's see. Okay, probably. Actually, can I use if I do a jump and then some rot on your face? That's a slow attack. Very slow attack. Okay, jump again and dragon breath. Ow. Okay, it wasn't instant death. And okay. Hmm. That was rather easy. I hear another dragon. Up here maybe? Yeah, okay, there's one. I think I hear one down there too. Uh let's see. Let's use some buffs maybe. I prefer not having to do this, but yeah, okay. Uh where's the dragon? There's the dragon. Okay, let's light up his ass. Get some more dragon fire. Come on then. Ow. Okay. Right then, uh, how about one of these little shots to the face? Doesn't do too much damage. Two end reaction, and jump and an attack. Oh, so close. Jump and an attack. It's flying. That's not allowed. Okay, and a jump and an attack. And a jump and an attack. Ooh. Yeah, I think I usually just run past these dragons. Let's see, maybe a little bit more of this action. It's just one dragon down here. Oh, there's two dragons down here. Oh. Might as well. And jump and breathe his ass full of rot. Okay. I, I can breathe too. And there's a lot of damage. Come on. Uh, not that one. Oh, okay. Sure. Let's see. And then we run up to him. Just jump and right click and breathe, you bastard. What does he do? Oh, that is what he's doing. Right. Okay. A little bit of this action. Doesn't do too much. Ow. Okay. Come on then, jump attack. Oh, oh, yeah, hit his legs. Doesn't do too much. Okay, and jump and attack. Okay, he's flying. Should be fine. Jump and an attack. Yes. Now, why are there two dragons around here? Is there something hidden? I don't remember. Let's see, that tower. Oh yeah, that's that tower over there. Who's this fella? Isolated merchant. I mean, sure. Let's talk to the isolated merchant. Okay. Uh, what do you have to sell? Uh, I don't remember these. Oh, right, the samurai thingamajigs. Note gateway, hidden cave. Uh, okay, sure. Yeah, I mean, Kaled was very scary the first time I was here, but now, I mean, I've, uh, I'm qu quite a high level. Come here, Duggo. And jump and a schmeck. And a double schmeck. <laughs> okay, that's some red eyes. Very ominous. 
But I think that I can just, you know, use a little bit. Where is it? It is a frenzied burst. Charge it up, try to hit the head. I mean, uh, not what I wanted to do, but sure. Oh, ow. Okay. Oh, that's a uh, active boil. Ow. Oof. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I still take damage, so the DLC is going to be interesting. I mean, most likely, if I do splurge and get myself the DLC, I am probably just going to uh, use this character, and then maybe if the DLC is incredibly good, I will uh, probably do another run. Yeah, normally when it comes to Dark Souls games, I only really do one run. See, I've been down there. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well. Alrighty. Yeah, I think that should do it. Just wanted to make a quick little video showing that I am preparing for eventuality of playing the DLC. But yeah, we, we will see. Looking rather dapper. I do enjoy these swords. A little bit of that action, and I can also use this. So yeah, faith strength build is something that I'm gonna go for, and maybe I can put the blasphemous blades aside. Because that only makes things a lot easier. Okay, why isn't he just um, ice glowing? Is this one easier? Whoop, whoop, and a jump and an attack. Whoop, and a jump and an attack. Ah, uh, yeah, jump attacks or something. Okay, one more doggo. Actually, let's see. Does fire do anything to these bastards? Come on in a little bit closer. And fire, and fire, and fire. Ah, huh? reaches quite far already. Yeah, but just a quick little video, so I um, think that I'm going to say, as always, until next time.